This is the moment of truth. I'll show you what it is. Right there's the number. That, my friends, is the sun coming up over the mountain. That means that it is early in the morning. What is up? Good morning. Today we just got a call from my friend. He works for the BYU Athletic Department and they do this really cool thing. Lincoln, I know we're super early, it's tired. Tell me what is going on, what is this BYU thing? They drop BYU boxes all over the states and there's like 800 of them. For 50 days before the football season starts, they have this cool campaign that started like three or four years ago that they go to all 50 states in the US and they take a BYU box or a helmet or some sort of prize and they take a picture of it and they just drop it. And the crazy thing is, literally within seconds sometimes, BYU fans show up wearing BYU shirts, that's the criteria, and people show up and then they get these prizes. We get to go and be a part of it and actually drop one of the boxes and choose the location, then have a challenge with the people that are there. We thought, let's bring you guys along for it. We don't even know where this thing's gonna go. We need to find like some sort of landmark or something here. The problem is, these BYU fans are so good about finding this stuff, we wanna go somewhere that's kind of hard. We will do a challenge, but what's inside challenge? Whoever wins the challenge gets to win the stuff. Slug bug yellow. Bam! You can't do that. Bam! Oh, you can't do that. He gets two hits because that one is an old one. No, so I get to hit you three times because I was up by one. I get to hit no. you six. No. I, Five, six. He just hit me six times. If he was up by one, and then I saw one that's worth two, that makes me up by one. So really, no, and then I, I hit am, him twice. I was I said one because I do the math. The that's just what you bug, hit me. The slug bug game. If you guys know the rules, let us know in the comments. But no, that's the rules. I'm gonna go get a donut. Okay, I broke the rules. I admit it. Look at that, Bowman's. But the donuts. Oh, I wish you could smell that. Look at this little guy with the BYU shirt on. All right, Lincoln. Let's get some donuts, dude. Life's not so bad, please. Do not be sad. Whoa! Look at all those donuts. Here's the deal. There's these people over here. They're all wearing BYU stuff, and so I'm pretty sure they're in. Why else would you be on a random Saturday? 7:30. That's so early. I yeah. There's no way. They're totally playing. So. The people just called, they're gonna meet us here, but I'm gonna call them and tell them, meet us outside. Because the fans are gonna see us and they're gonna start following us. Our friends are gonna meet us here, they have the box. They have the box. They need like security around it. These are our friends. Do you have the goods? We're getting them right now. So we don't have the secret package. It's gonna be here in just about one minute. We gotta make this a top secret location. I don't think the donut place is the place to do it. Wearing the wrong shirt. If you show up in a red Utah Ute shirt, you're not gonna get it, so there's no way that kid's getting anything. I'm not even giving him a donut wearing that shirt around here. Jeez. This is it, I think this is it. I see a BYU shirt. Do you have the box? We do have the box. Yes! We do there's already people in there that were like looking, so we have to be secret. Hey, the mayor is here. You? How's it going? Good to see you. From key to the city. Do you guys know a good secret place that we can go to? We gotta go somewhere that's a lot more secret than here. We should probably go before they get their kids in their car seats. Let's go, we'll follow you guys. We have the mayor with us, so all I will say is that we went 25 miles an hour at the speed limit, but it was fast <laughs> enough, whatever we did, to lose that minivan. I don't see him back there. They said something about like a park by the mountain. I didn't even know Kaysville goes up on the mountain, so this is gonna be a tricky one. Look at that, the sun just went down again. That's how far, how close we are to the mountains. Are you sure this is Kaysville? We are about to drive back into Kaysville. Technically, you have to leave Kaysville to get back into Kaysville. So it's it's a unique one. It'll be a it'll be a tough find. Oh yeah, look at that East Mountain Wilderness Park, Kaysville City. There's a lot of people here. The thing is, they are not looking for a box. They are just getting exercise and hiking. We get an all white BYU helmet with a blue chrome. Why finish on it? Wow, let's see this helmet. So here's the grand prize. Okay, let's see this thing. Oh, that's, that looks like a real helmet. That is a real helmet. We have not done one like this. Oh. That's interesting. That's heavy. Isn't that cool? That is heavy. So we cut open a football helmet, and it was a BYU football helmet. But they've definitely updated the technology since then. Okay, so she's setting it down. She's taking the official picture for Twitter right now. Early morning, sunrise. 
There we go, I think that's the shot. How hard is it after this? Do people like follow you in their cars? Yeah. People like we have last new year, Mission Impossible esque last like year we spent maneuvers on an the road. Hour oh trying gosh. to lose someone. She's yeah. tweeting it right now. This is happening. Come find us. Okay, I tweeted it. Yeah. Stopwatch is going. Okay, Dave, how long do you think it's gonna take for the first person to come out, come here? Ten minutes. Okay, what do you think, Mayor? I think a lot. thirteen minutes. <laughs> you just try to go one more than me. <laughs> We're three minutes and 23 seconds into this right now, and nobody is here yet. Feeling optimistic. Though. This is gonna be good. Oh boy, here come some cars. I see pink shirt. Somebody pointed. They pointed. Oh, they're taking the seatbelt off already, they know. Be what you on the windows. What? Oh my gosh. License plate BYU. This is a thing. This is a thing, we're only four minutes into it right now and a van just pulled up with BYU fans. This is insane. And this isn't just because we're in Utah. This happens yeah. all over the United States. You guys are number one. Congrats. Nice. Last weekend. Nice. Where do, you, do you live in Kaysville or what? How did this? Really, really, it's just down really the close. Did you know that this was Kaysville? Yeah, I did. No, she did. I did. Okay, okay. okay. This is, it can't be it, it's three heights. So you guys were all ready today. You're like, the, the, it's dropping yeah, we in Kaysville. Yeah. We were, we yeah. We got, we totally I saw ready. that they did the Provo drop this morning at 1 a.m. I was like, oh, it's going to be any time day. <laughs> They're coming in a helicopter. <laughs> That's, that's the real deal right there. So we still, it's we're probably 10 minutes in. We still have the one family. Every minivan that pulls up, we're like, oh, that's gotta be it. And I think it's just like a total stereotype of Mormons that you have a minivan because you're Mormon. But every one of them were like, oh, there's BYU fans. But then it's not. They're just like people with mountain bikes and they're going mountain biking on the trail. Oh, oh man, they're flying in now. Look at this. Cruising in. Whoa. There's one. Three, Contestant four. number three. <laughs> Contestant <laughs> number four. Oh, yeah. yeah, there's oh, another yeah. one. Getting out of the car. Yeah, there's seven. Is it worth getting out of the car, he said. That's like the <laughs> ultimate lazy right there. You know what Were you was? cruising around Kaysville waiting? No, I wasn't expecting it this early. I was <laughs> out to mow the lawn. I have uh, 17 minutes and 20 seconds. Oh, that timer. So what if we wait until 20 minutes and Perfect. then we call it? We'll wait for 20 and then see who we have. Okay, so right now we're at six contestants for this box, six. And we have two and a half minutes left. Let's see if anybody else can zoom around the corner. Yeah, that's another one. They're coming. This is just a Saturday morning workout. We have 30 seconds left. Oh, this car just pulled up right there with eight seconds to spare. He better run. Yeah. Time is up. You just barely made the cutoff. Wow, get that shirt on. You made it. Go Utes. He drops oh. the ball, clearly. What was he thinking? Go yeah. is this guy? Hope you get a flat tire. First 15 or however many people, one person from each group. We're gonna guess how many M&Ms are in the jar. The person who is closest will win. Yeah. All right, that's what's inside the jar here. Here we go. What's inside the jar? And we have the answer written down on a piece of paper. I'll hold this. You got it, it's all you. All right. A lot of nervous people here. This is the moment of truth. I'll show you what it is. Right there's the number. Lincoln, what, Lincoln, come here. What's your guess? Come tell the camera real quick. How many do you think is in it? Wait, to guess? Yeah, just guess. For, for fun. Like. What do you think? Take five. Two. Is it all have it in? Okay, I'll tell you the number. It is. Let me pull out the paper. Five twelve. Wow. <laughs> is that more than you thought? <laughs> more or less? There's 512 closest, in there. I got 535. I'm close. This is the winner, 535. I'm going back to bed. <laughs> <laughs> At least people get t-shirts. That was pretty close. He guessed pretty close. Lincoln, what are your thoughts on this? That was fun. Are you surprised at how many people got here? Yeah. Me too. I was looking at the jar, it looked like we could stack about 10 up, and then I thought seven rows across and seven rows across, and that came out to 490. And I thought that was actually a little low, so I added like... That is really smart. What do you do for work? Rocket scientist or something? <laughs> I'm just a lawyer. You're just, just a lawyer. He's a lawyer. Of course he got it right. You can't handle the truth. That's the lawyer good. wins. That's, that's pretty good. Yeah. What's inside? Uh, there you go. I do donuts. Donuts. 
Oh, that's... <laughs>